Hi there, it's Elizabeth Pfeiffer from ElizabethPfeiffer.com and today's topic of conversation is empowered connections. And we bring this up because I get a lot of questions about how do I connect with my guides? How do I connect with my angels? Um, very, very rarely do I ever get the question of how do I connect with my soul? <laughs> Which is the question you should be asking first. Um, we have a tendency to want to look externally for the information that we hold within ourselves already. We have a tendency to give our power away to our guides, to give our power away to our team members, to the angels. We ask them to basically tell us what to do. And in actuality, we seem to forget or we don't want to take responsibility for the fact that we are creating our own reality. And your guides and your angels are not here to live your life for you or to tell you what to do or give you the solutions to any of the questions. So if you have any guides or angels on your team who are actually giving you solutions and things to do, you know, I would be very wary of that. <laughs> That's not their job, number one. Um, and number two, they're here to guide you. They're not here to do for you. So when you are connecting in an empowered way with your guides and with your angels, um, we, or, we always ask to um, have that information sent to you at the level of your higher self, of your soul, your essence, that higher aspect of you um, who is free from any ego limitations. So it's kind of like, they meet up here in the higher realms and here's your your essence and here's your guides and your angels and they kind of come up and they have this little conversation with you down here and then you at the level of your higher self will download that information to you so that you're receiving that information that guidance from you um filtered by you so it doesn't have to go through your filter of your ego or any of your beliefs it comes straight down from source we always invite people who are first starting out um, with their own psychic intuition to go to your source first, um, and that is your higher self, to build that relationship first, because that will increase your confidence, it will increase your trust, it will increase levels of faith, you'll know what the information is sounding like, and you're less likely to be... Um, fooled by other energies pretending to be your guides. Believe me, I've done that. I've spent years talking to energies that um, weren't who they said they were. And, you know, I found out the hard way. And so right here in this little, I don't know, 10 minute video, we're saving you at least 10 years of experience of not having to go down that road. So um, your guides don't give you the solutions. They don't give you the answers. It's your journey. You're the one who's creating it. You are creating it with every thought, feeling and belief that you have and your guides can't do that they're not vibrating around you with um, a different set of frequencies that is creating your reality you are creating it and so when you're able to tap in to your own soul's essence then you're able to identify what it is get really clear clarity of information what it is that you want to create how it is that you're going to do it and then receive action and guidance steps directly from your source on where to go with next. And then you can ask your guides and your angels to help you with that. So you already have the solution. You already have the goal of where you want to go, where you want to go. And then you're delegating to them um, tasks in order to help you achieve your goal. So they're not telling you what to create and how to create it. They're gonna be here to help you create what you've already decided that you want to create in your own life. So we call that empowered connection. Empowering yourself first, connecting with your own source uh, energy, your own higher self, getting that information or getting any information directly from your guides or angels simply by saying you know if you have an energy around you and this happens all the time you know, people you know energy just shows up you just say okay guys seventh plane up to my higher self up to source give me that information up there and then source will bring it down to me in a clean clear way in which that i can understand and process um, in this physical dimension so we invite you to go within to get your information 
not externally, because the moment you do that, you give your power away and they will not take it. So we hope that that was helpful. If so, please leave us some comments below and please feel free to share on your social networks. Talk to you soon. Bye.